Do you think a 2019 dime is valuable? A regular business strike dime, minted for everyday use. Not an error, not a variety. We'll talk about them right after this. Hey YouTubers, this is JNB, and welcome to our JB Coins family. We're all about coins and currency and are here to help you either start your new collection, expand an existing one, or find that one valuable coin that could change your life. This video is about the newest dimes struck in 2019. Dimes you should know about and look for them now because they're worth good money. We'll be talking about the coins in the highest grades and as usually happens, the same happened in 2019, these first coins that were discovered, graded and sold will bring the most money. They are very valuable. You'll be surprised what nice money they're bringing at auctions. We will also talk about special finish on them. So let's start with the coins minted in the Philadelphia Mint. By the way, because they are new issues and you can still buy them from the US Mint, mintages on newer dimes are not yet specified. So dimes struck in 2019 at the Philadelphia Mint will bear a P mint mark and have a regular business strike finish. When we're talking about business strike dimes, you need to remember that some will have an FT or FB designation and they will bring extra money to any dime. Now full bands or FB or full torch or FT are grading designations which can be applied to Roosevelt dimes. In general, the attribution indicates a coin with a strong, well-defined strike, as evidenced by full details on the torch located on the reverse of the coin. You see a picture of the Roosevelt dime reverse and the torch. PCGS is using the term full bands, while NGC uses full torch but it doesn't mean that coins without the FB or FT are not worth good money. If they're in high grades, they still are. But with the FB or FT, they are definitely worth more. This coin is the latest sale of the dime with the FT designation, graded MS68. And this coin sold at auction for $800. It's absolutely great money for such a new coin. Moving on to dimes struck at the Denver Mint, the minages obviously are also not known yet. These coins will bear a D mint mark. The highest grade known for this dime is an MS69 full bands. And this coin sold at auction for $900, which is pretty amazing, but there's more. There are some 2019 dimes that have been graded in PL or proof-like finish. The dime from the Philadelphia Mint has not been found in that finish yet, so look for them. This 2019 Denver dime in grade MS69 full torch Proof-like, sold in October 2019 for $700. There's another one recently listed for sale on eBay at $1,295. If it sells for this money, we don't know. But what we do know is that you should definitely look for them. And you can still buy the 2019 uncirculated mint sets directly from the U.S. Mint, where you can find coins in beautiful condition. Also, a short tip here. 
the new coins for 2020 are coming soon. So you can buy boxes from the bank without paying a premium and possibly be one of the first people who will discover the first best possible examples for 2020. Another tip, the 2019 dimes do have many errors, so look for them. Pay attention to any odd looking coin and always check both sides of the coin, any coin, not just the dimes. And if you're curious about the values of 2018 dimes, please watch our video about them linked in the upper corner of this one. And before we sign off, we'd like to thank all of you who've become a member of our channel. If you'd like to become a JB Coins Inc. coin family member, please follow the link below this video. Also, please let us know in the comment section below if you'd ever expect the new dimes to be that valuable. So we hope you liked this video and found it helpful. And if you did, please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching, and until next time, J&B, signing off.